Morning Malaysia, this is Jericho here. Today is the whatever. What's today's date? No idea. Uh, 1st of February 2017, Wednesday 7.27 p.m. On my computer. Woke up quite early. I'm going to go to Penang soon. So this video is about what I actually have on my persons when I'm out and about filming. And you can see the Fumakila, which is a killer of insects, mainly mosquitoes. Fumakila. With a, uh, with a what's called elephant in the middle. So let's see here. This is what I, the man bag that I bring with me. Pockets wise, you can see here, the mom, mom just fixed it about 5 minutes ago with raffia, a very strong string. Uh, elephant string, maybe? Who knows? There's an elephant. Gun, so there might be an elephant string. So uh, repair this part here because it's got a hole. Repair this part here got a hole. Oh, okay. Here is uh, okay. It, as long as it does not like tear some more. Wait, why did my mom? Okay, forget. Anyway, so let's see. Gotta continue on looking for Emily Bloom Mad Art. So. Hmm. Three pockets in front here, so you're gonna see everything there in one at the side. One, two, three, four, five. Small ones here for the, the for the pens and whatnot. Oh shit! If I put pens in it, it seems like very nerdy. Front part here, there's nothing. Just the uh, I'm not sure male female thing that goes onto this one here. The soft part here, so it's close, open, close. This one, a big pocket, a big pocket here. And this one here, there's a mini pocket here, you can close it with a zip here. And there's that's all, there's nothing else inside this thing. That's all, that's the end of the pockets. It's a very old bag that I whipped out from the box, which is was this one, carrots bag, uh, carrots thing. I got it when I was in university, and now I whipped, I mean, I've been using this for like maybe two years, or three years, or four years, or five years, I'm not sure. So let's see, I got to download something. Wait, uh. So let's continue on. So let's pack it in. First off, this bag here, which is at the side. I mean, at the side that's nearest to my body. I'm gonna put it at the back of this thing here before I flip it down. So what's inside here? Let's see. There's the Joey L plastic bag, which is uh, can put shit in it, like say water bottles in case I wanted it. So it's uh, very packed into a very fine uh, piece of uh, polyester thing. Square, small, square. And this is a zip on black bag which I do not zip at all. Logo here, VIP and uh, my uh, contributors, Wilson Lee, my patron, five US dollars a month from Singapore. Kenshin of E from Kepong, who sometimes translates, especially when the the seller is speaking in something I do not know. Like can, very sophisticated Cantonese, Mandarin, Hokkien hopefully. So you can see in the comments below what he might have said uh, through the eyes or through the translation of Mr. Kenshin who is also uh, uh, a bit more worse V-E-R-S-E -E in the la Chinese language than I. Uh, Joey, <coughs> Joey L. Uh, what do you call, uh, call it? Joey L type of tissue. And of course the cable that is for my power bank here that connects to my where's my camera oh the camera is here uh, that gives me six hours of uh, filming continuously no problem and in this smaller red bag which i've taken from uh, swiss garden of malacca uh, it was on the table so i'm not sure what it is according to my mom she says that it is for customers to leave unpaus which is kind of weird actually shouldn't they be giving us ampau instead of us giving them ampau no idea but i just take the this thing here and i did, haven't washed washed it yet i'm scared it might the whole thing will turn red some plastic bag inside just in case i need to like cover things when it rains like my mp3 player so at least there's a plastic bag with a rubber band inside it just in case i need to use a rubber band then this is from mercedes benz this thing here uh maybe i can tie stuff with it like my water bottle the head of the water bottle and the water bottle will be tied to my strap i mean that metal thing 
which is like that metal thing there so many things that uh, can be done and this one is always on my jeans that I'm using on the left side for the water bottle there will be this pack here with a green thing here which is called the blue tag I'm not sure whether I have blue tag no. the blue tag is uh, what you might call it this one is just for like say you know the tripod the tripod has a uh, three legs I uh, put the the green tag under the legs and from there I can put the the tripod and the camera itself onto a ledge uh, normally there will be a glass in shopping complexes you know upstairs in first floor if the activity or the event is happening on the ground floor and I cannot get a good vantage point around the ground floor when I'm on the ground floor then I'll go to the first floor and snipe pretty girls from there and to get a steadier uh, thing than to hold this thing free uh, hold this thing with my hand it will be very shaky shaky especially at 40 times zoom so when I deploy this thing with this stabilizer get stuck to the railing or the glass piece of glass then it's much better so this is quite useful I haven't used it yet but this is an idea that I want to use later this thing here normally uh, houses uh, watermelon powdered watermelon that's good for the heat hay or heaty person especially when they have this type of uh, ailment called sore throat yeah ailment called sore throat but this is empty inside this there are two blades which is a uh, blade for the hobby knife here of course this one is uh, already very dark that means it has oxidized thanks to a process called rusting because it's metal so moisture and metal equals Ox ferrous or ferrum oxide rust and this string here is the one that I want this is a floss so I tied the floss in uh, both ends of the floss to the blades so it'll be easier for me to just take it out and whip it out easily with the blades as a like anchor and voila where I would have the floss because my teeth is like sometimes when I eat food outside and there are stuff inside uh, between my teeth like meat normally or maybe pieces of uh, what you call pieces of uh, of bone because I like to crunch and eat the bones of the chicken you get stuck and it's not comfortable and it's unsightly especially chicken pieces uh, chicken meat is uh, like very white in the middle or something like my teeth so floss is very important so it will be easily accessible when I have it on my persons so close it up a bit and uh, you know this wire normally is inside here but I know that I'm going to use it for the trip to Penang maybe I would uh, film the way to Penang but I don't think so because I've already done it many times and it's dull so logo here I'm going to go to Penang to maybe buy some shoes 50% off sale now then with the coupons in the logo thing here and also a couple of types of uh, coupons like 30 ringgit off if you show them that you liked the logo Facebook page and write I love logo then there's the birthday 150 ringgit off uh, not my birthday birthday was some time ago but you can use it and of course uh, a coupon for 50 bucks uh, that's normally comes with this uh, thing here then there's a platinum card inside that that uh, makes it makes me eligible for the 20% off so maybe hopefully from uh, I say uh, 400 ringgit no a 250 ringgit shoe becomes because of the 50% off during this Chinese New Year maybe it comes 100 ringgit and from 100 ringgit with all the coupons here maybe you get a shoe that's less than 50 ringgit who knows let's go to Penang Gani Plaza there wait is it Gurney Plaza or Gurney? I'm not sure which one. Uh, which uh, ah Paragon. Paragon is the place that has the logo. There are only two places so far that I know of. Evolve Concept Mall in Petaling Jaya and and uh, Paragon Mall in Penang or Gurney Drive. So this bag here, which is uh, it's got a bit of weight into it, so stuff stuff it in. Oh, and my media credentials. Where's my media thing? inside I think ah here it is the media thing from Yuna is oh wait, Yuna for Los Troveda Yuna is the girl Malay girl who, who sings songs 
that one I put it in here just for official things so just stuff it in here and close it up with the flap like so and it's disappeared so when I want to access it there will be stuff inside this pocket so I just half close it and clip it open so that the contents of this bag here won't fall off normally it's uh, cigarettes I put inside here so in the background is uh, Alan Tam singing this very popular song not sure what's the name of so next up is here this is a bag of sweets uh, lemon salted from uh, lemon salted candy from Japan which you, can, which you can get anywhere now you don't need to go to any Japanese centric stores or Daiso do they sell it in Daiso? I'm not sure so plastic bags here will go to the bottom just in case that I want to like uh, waterproof my stuff especially when I'm out and about and it rains and I don't want my camera to go wet and berserk so put the plastic inside uh, more plastic bags this is a very use useful thing which is the laundry bag from a hotel any hotels they have laundry bags and they are very good plastic bags they are not biodegradable it's real plastic so you won't get flaky uh, plastics uh, flaky plastic things after some time because of biodegradation this is some uh, wet wipes from a Chinese restaurant called the Crab House restaurant in Ipoh Garden East delicious crabs but these ones normally are paid for so I must well grab them and not leave it on the table these are wet wipes just in case my I took a shit and I don't have any paper and I need to like wipe it with some watery stuff yeah very important to have a nice clean ass after shitting uh, Swiss Garden Swing Kit, I haven't opened it yet so I'm not sure what I'm going to use it with but it's useful because there's a utensil called a needle which is very small like my Chinese prick and uh, that's good for pricking stuff like say the mp3 player if it suddenly kongs out or just gets stuck so there's a small little hole that you can use to like reset it back into working order normally it works and of course for the handphone there's also a small little prick I mean small little hole which is uh, this one here this one is not uh, audio or a microphone or or a speaker that's a reset button so once it hangs or does not turn on you just press the button with a small little prick uh, don't need to use your Asian Chinese cock or oriental cock for that purpose but use the sewing kit which is there but I already have a sewing kit which is oh sorry not sewing kit a needle which comes with my uh, mp3 player here which comes with the cable here to connect it to a laptop because that's how it recharges and uh, this is the the little swing kit because uh, this mp3 player sometimes it hangs so there's a hole there and there's a swing kit here I mean sorry a needle here then I just prick the small hole and it resets itself so yeah a lot of uh, things that uh, are quite useful and lastly this one here is uh, something from a calendar the yellow I mean the you know uh, uh, pyramid calendar put on the table to stand up right this is the back of it and I just folded it and became like this and I waterproofed it with a plastic bag and I, uh, I further waterproofed it with uh, cellophane tape with the big ones or masking tape and uh, it will become the base of my my bag normally my bag will be quite long but with this thing here it straightens it out so my long I mean I can like put my shit st my stuff quite deep inside because it will become like from flat becomes like like so and it's longer and can stuff more stuff inside but with this base here it's a bit more difficult because it restricts the movement of the things so I'll put it in so so now it's inside there at, as a base okay done next up my small little bag here with my three uh, extra very like date type of uh, batteries and here would be my SD cards yeah SD cards here so this is useless this is dead already this is uh, micro SD to big SD this is fucking dead I'm not sure why I carry it with me because, because it doesn't work anymore this connection is just sucks balls 
micro SDs, 32 gigs and 64 gigs respectively. And here there are three, eh? there are three S, two or three, two. I think it's two. The two SD card, SD cards. One is eight gigabytes Toshiba, and the one is 32 gigabytes SanDisk. So, so here is uh, 32. 32 gigabytes gives me three hours. Yep, three hours. So this is 64 gig. So three hours <laughs> plus six hours nine. Nine plus three hours twelve hours. And uh, okay. nine twelve. This one eight gigabytes is about forty minutes. Twelve, twelve forty. 12 hours and 40 minutes. This one here, another 32 gigabytes. Uh, 12 hours and 40 minutes. 15 hours and 40 minutes of uh, filming. Yeah. Yes, that's how long I can film. What was it really? 15 hours and 40 minutes. Yeah, 15 hours and 40 minutes without the uh, use of the laptop for storage or anything. So on the go, I can just film 15 hours. So <clears throat> let's put these things back in here and at the back down below this uh, battery will be some of those pellets that sucks water so I want to like don't want too much moisture with my important shit like these batteries and SD cards because water would fuck things up as usual but of course it's a giver of life or the uh, the valley eh? oh where did this come from? Uh, wait. That means it's uh, 18 hours and 40 minutes. This one come from where? I better check it out for, on my laptop and see whether there's stuff inside it or not. Ah. Already. Oh fuck! I s have another. Oh, I almost forgot. This is another. I already. I thought I would like put everything inside the laptop. And I put inside the the portable hard drive so now there's more shit to put into so bear with me shit so more sh more stuff from Laka a lot of stuff from Laka so now I'm cutting the data back into the laptop and uh, I think 18 hours and 40 minutes was the last count so yeah 18 hours and 40 minutes of of stuff to film in at one go so let's put this back here inside, small little bag, and this other bag which has my SD card, which I'm going to put like so, inside here, put in here, and my uh, 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 camcorder normally sits in, inside this pocket here, protected by the uh, soft lining of this small little thing here, as to not touch anything that's metal or sharp that would fuck up the the you know screen uh, the protective lens the crystal lens which uh, was purchased also at the same time as this camcorder was purchased uh, sugar stuff hex I'm going to reload this with hex so I'm gonna have to put more hex uh, okay I'm gonna get some hex okay mm -hmm. yes that's my suspender what time is it Ah, oh, 10 minutes to 8 p. 8 a.m. Here's my mom. Mom's the best mom in the world. Mom, you know. Because you are. <laughs> so, what's, uh, where's the hex? Uh, I thought there was a bag of hex on the side of this. This. Ah, uh, yeah, there it is. Hex is very nice. I mean, for suppressing cough. Uh. Don't take four, that's a bad number, take five. What? You also believe it, huh? No, I just like to like make a fool out of all these things by just always like telling them like that. So they'll be indoctrinated if they watch this, especially the Gaijin's Kwai Lows or Gringos. Last time, you still. Last night, last night. Oh, last night, okay. No, I don't like Feng Shui at all. Because my mother tried to force it on me, so I hate it. Hate Feng Shui. Stupid.
I mean some of it is just logical stuff you just have to think of it logically that's all <sighs> especially in the placement of the stuff in the house don't make it too like what you call don't make it too hoardy or hoarder like make sure the place is like easy easy to maneuver through all your collection of shit in your house and feng shui when they say oh you gotta be this side the, the door has to be at these degrees and blah 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 oh god hated it hate feng shui it's just a money making scheme for people who are supposed to be masters bullshit masters of bullshit i tell you this one is my uh wallet so I put it at the side this one here, my MP3 player, the side. Did I tell you that my left ear is kind of like weaker than my right ear? Just recently, about less than two weeks. Strange. Fisherman's friend is good for suppressing cough and maybe laughter. Uh, my SD, no SD power bank, which gives me maybe six hours of uh, filming. It's fully charged, right? Yes, it's fully charged. It's put to the side, on the right side, and you can see that it's already broken here. So. But it's easy to access. That's what you want your girlfriends or wife to be easily accessible. <laughs> uh, my S my name cards. There are two sections divided by uh, cards from the QQ card, which is a uh, uh, oh this is Miss Shoko Ishizawa, very cute girl from Japan, from Nippon Print Company, and uh, Yixun Enterprise, which uh, you get pirated Gundams from on Jalan Raja Laut. So it divides between the very cheap, free, flimsy paper that carries my name and how to get to my address or my, uh, excuse me, website or YouTube channel. And at the back here is the, the harder one that I printed on art paper. So I haven't even done my, what should we call it, name cards. So printed it in a... Uh, Swiss Garden Hotel Malacca. Thank you very much for letting me print about 30 to 40 pieces of 30 I think 30 pieces of paper that has 10 flimsy printed name cards That means I got 400 400 uh, flimsy paper to distribute among the hawkers and the ones that are thicker ones is for official business the important people so I have to impress them with with a thicker name card and all the rest of the things that haven't been processed that means cut with my hobby knife there and a metal uh, ruler here which guides the very sharp hobby knife to slice it up into smaller pieces quite easy but when it's very thick it's very difficult to slice through the paper so there are many more pieces here so I, I don't really need to make real name cards so far when it comes to name cards you give the name cards uh, the most expensive name card is like say maybe roughly 30 cents 30 cents that's uh, less than 10 US cents per card you give it to them and they might throw it away and uh, what is, what's the fucking point so I might as well just print it it's fucking free and it's flimsy as fuck so if they throw it away I wouldn't be that pissed off this is a light especially uh, useful for dark situations without the, s the help of the sun to light your way and also when I'm uh, in Penang uh, well tenting or setting up camp after returning from Georgetown or whatever I'm filming when I return or come back from the Ipo, not Ipo, Penang Swimming Club after taking a shower recharging my my handphone and uh, camcorder and everything else it will be around 10 p.m. 11 p.m. and it will be dark as fuck especially from the main road of Batu Feringi going down to the beach there will be a flight of steps it's about one story high so go down it's dark use this uh, this lovely pen what do you call it? pen flashlight is it from Panasonic that I got from the road show a road show that was in Malacca I went there for a day trip to attend this one which gave me only this thing here which of course uh, is useful so it, that flashlight is underneath whereas upstairs would be the very accessible name card holder here that has a mirror and I can see myself you are weighing enough so let's go nerdy nerdy knife here which uh, doubles as a pen like thing so people sometimes frisk you for stuff and uh, they, think, they think this is a pen but it's actually a pen knife 
This one here is a new addition to the family of stuff in my bag. This is a HDL XL LDL. That means it's high density lipoprotein, low density hypoprotein. You use something called the XL or some product name. I think I'm not sure. This is a part of Novartis Pharmaceutical or MSD Pharmaceutical or some other pharmaceuticals. But this is a new addition. It comes with a screwdriver. And uh, this thing here with a hole in it, I'm not sure what this is for actually. And there might be, if I need to like chop down a tree, then I can use all these utensils. Is there a saw here? Yeah, if I need to chop down a tree. If, if I need to, if I'm stranded on an island and I need to make a raft, then this might come in handy. Uh, fuck, I don't, I don't know. Uh, much oh yeah uh, just in case you need to like file your nails if it's too rough then you can use this thing and on this side here there will be a I'm not sure what this is uh, then there's a uh, which you call not very sharp scissor there and this is a flat screwdriver I think maybe who knows uh, fuck it I don't know then there's supposed to be a knife then there'll be a, ah the saw to saw down a tree yes or to chop down a piece of metal rod then this one I'm not sure what it is for maybe for meat and a regular knife here which I think is not sharp I forget I don't know so it's quite heavy it's quite bloody fucking heavy actually put it inside Con conceal a weapon with another weapon here this is norm this pen knife is normally when I did like back then I did not like buy the cheap cigarettes which is four ringgit or less than ten less than one US dollar this cheap untaxed stuff kill you one day but it's cheap what to do no money so before i was buying all those cheap cigarettes sometimes i have the urge to like say smoke and i don't have any but any place that can sell me single cigarettes so i would just look for those cigarettes that are not fully finished i take it from the ashtray or whatever and uh, from there use this knife to cut the you know the filter there so as to make it into half and I won't be in contact with the other smoker's saliva so thus preventing or possibly preventing diseases, diseases like syphilis, hepatitis, uh, AIDS and whatnot. of course I'm joking <clears throat> so pen here, two of them one is a black pen which is a marker type of pen uh, from Daiso I think there's a sh small little head and a big little head uh, back then, about say maybe six months ago, I was writing shit on my hand just to tell the time because uh, I would start recording at a certain amount of time, then I write down because I want to keep my videos as short as possible. But nowadays, fuck it, I don't care. It's long form already, so uh, viewers might like or might not like, so I'm too bad. Because back in YouTube now, if it's shorter videos, it will be higher views and people won't fall asleep when they are watching if it's too long they wouldn't want to watch at all because you can't sustain a very interesting video at a very long duration so five minutes is best if you're trying to make a video don't do it like moi moi do it very special special because me jericho very fucking special so this one is just for tying of food which is given free or my water bottle is next to this uh, strap here so how to actually position it you have to have a certain way i'm not uh, adhd or mentally impaired of i'm just super fussy you know sometimes it's easier to put at, on one side and easier to put on the other side uh, easy entry is the most important thing condoms not required uh nope, no 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 just the other side actually Shit. I'll just move it around. Actually, I prefer. Ah, fuck it. <coughs> A lot of gas yesterday ate a peanut sauce. My mom's excellent peanut sauce. I think it's actually there, okay. Uh, it's very, very crunchy. That's what the. You know, nowadays, the uh, satay sauce. Uh, Makers, uh, peanuts are not crunchy. Fuck, it's all like tofu. Don't like that. So now it's done. 
So everything is done for sure. So see you next time. Like, subscribe. That's the genesis of my man bag. Or what's inside my man bag. Anything else to put inside my man bag? Oh, the stuff that I got from Ching Sen, which is a girl that I met in uh, Form 6. Uh, she was um, some kind of wizard thing here, so from the Lego, so I'm uh, not gonna use it. Uh, secrets here, new ones. Actually, I got the old one outside, so I'm not gonna put it inside my bag. Oh, sh I'm gonna put inside my bag, of course. Uh, lighter here, dump it inside this pocket here. And that's it. That's my bag of dreams and Fumakila and elephant. So it's time to buy a new bag, a bigger one. It's heavy. So that's me. You see somebody using this bag, it's me. There's nobody else with this bag, okay? It's not generic, it's super special. So that's it. See you in the next one. Like, subscribe, and tell your friends, tell your mother, tell your father. So tell everybody. Like, subscribe, help me out. I want to achieve 1 million subscribers by the end of this year. And by the end, by the middle of next year, 2018, I want to get like 55 million subscribers, uh, same as PewDiePie, and uh, yeah, help me in achieving that. Tell your friends in Malaysia, or overseas, whatever. Tell them the fuckery that I'm up to, the boringness that I have in my 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 YouTube channel, and uh, I will give you brownie points in the form of shit. Brownie points, you know, uh, the pony, little pony, my little pony. Oh. And if you leave good comments, you get brownie points in the form of shit. No, 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 no. I will just love you more. And of course, if you want to contribute to the, what do you call, like they like to say, to the community, the Jerry Cook community, you can do so, like, uh, Wilson Lee by giving me money. And of course, uh, subtitle, not subtitle, explanation of the, what the hawker said in Chinese, uh, like Kenshin of Kepung, Kuala Lumpur. I think Kepung is Kuala Lumpur, right? North of Kuala Lumpur should be Kepung. I haven't, re haven't visited Kepung. What's it Kepung is on the... Southeast, I think so. Southeast, maybe. I'm not sure. North or southeast? I think it's north. Fuck it. Who cares? I mean, I care. I care. Kenshin, I care. Because you are a contributor to the community. That's what uh, everybody in the YouTube, they want to foster community. So that's... Mm, fuck it. I don't know what the hell is happening. So, if you leave a bad comment, shadow ban. So, make sure it's positive that what you're saying. If it's, uh, you want to say recommendations or, oh, you should tone down the, the naughty bad words. You don't need to say that, okay? You don't need to say that. Don't risk yourself of getting me pissed off and shadow banning you. So, thank you very much. I love you. And, bye-bye.